Hello guys, Dennis here and welcome to the first episode of Minecraft Tutorials. Um, let's see, uh, maybe not tutorials, but um, a video request. Uh, I think I'm gonna call it Minecraft Tutorial, uh, but it's going to be mostly uh, video requests, so to speak. Uh, for example, if there's a building that I didn't really go well in depth with, uh, you can kind of ask me to do it fully, and I will do it on this series. Uh, as far as I can remember, of course. Uh, this wall is actually one too high. I'm seeing that now. That is unfortunate. You know what, we, we can fix that. If we just quickly go ahead and grab one of these guys, uh, we can perhaps just... Just fill it quickly in like this. Because, uh... Uh, this is a request made by Orgoncade. Um... Because I have a wall on the Craft Theory server, uh, which is uh, filled in with... Oh, sorry. <laughs> I was actually supposed to hit him, but um, I failed. Oh. Uh, I made a cobblestone wall on the backside of my base on the server, and she has asked me to kind of show how, it's, uh, how I built it. Um... So, I'm thinking that, sure, why not? So, that is kind of what we're going to be doing today. And I don't remember exactly how I did it, but I have gone in, taken a little bit of a look, and uh, hopefully I will be getting it correctly. Hopefully. Uh, now, I'm not going to be using the same area as the Craft Theory server, uh, because I don't have the seed. I don't have the seed for that world, and, um... Even if I did... I, I, I... Wouldn't remember exactly how I did it either, so... Uh, it, it would be different either way, but I just... I can't forgot... I can't believe I forgot to fill this in before I started recording! This is kind of uh, derpiness that I'm hoping to avoid in the future, just FYI. Uh, you know what? Um, I wish there was a tool in which I could just mark up the area and have it done. But uh, I am i don't have world edit. I don't have it. Uh, so this is fine. Let's see, we spent about two minutes on that. There we go. Okay. Uh, I th Wait. It was the right height. Thank. It was. Dang it. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. So. Uh, what I did. Approximately. Was that I had a wall of three blocks. Of just dirt. It was just dirt to begin with, right? And what I then did was that I went into it and removed one layer in and went like that. I think I did something like that. And then I went in and kind of uh, some places I went a little bit. No, I didn't. What am I doing? Uh, what am I doing? <laughs> uh, for a second now, I completely forgot how I did it. Um, some of the places I have... Cobble uh, stairs going like this. Some places I don't. And what we're gonna do... Is we are gonna go ahead and do that. We're gonna go ahead and do that. And... Then on top of here, we're gonna go like so. There there, there, maybe one there, 
then we can have this kind of going down a little bit. Uh, just quickly, like, having it going a little bit like this. And then right here, we can go like that. Right there, we can go right there. We're actually also going to go right there. And we can go with that one out like so. And then down there. And down like so. A little bit of something like that. Uh, and then uh, I want to add a little bit of detail into the wall itself. So we can go, for example, like this, just like so. There. And maybe right here we can go like that. Maybe right here we can go like that. And maybe we can go even with this one right here. And let's see, if we go like so, yeah, that could work. Then we have a little bit of depth into the wall itself, which I think is pretty good. And then what I want is a little bit of diversity in the texture of the wall itself. So we are going to go ahead and get some of these guys. So we can go, for example, right there, right there. Uh, right there, right there, we're gonna go with gravel, gravel I said, there we go. A little bit of um, different textures like that. And what I also did, uh, I think, was that I went something like, like this. Oh, come on, come on, there we go. Uh, we can do that, and then we can even go right there, remove that one, we're gonna go in here, uh, wait, I forgot about Acacia Logs, that works very well with cobblestone in my opinion, uh, so I think we're gonna go right there with it, uh, kind of in the back there, uh, kind of hidden a little bit. Then we can go right there, and we can go, um, yeah, sure, why not right here? There we go. That's something. Uh, it's, it's, it's a little bit at least. And that is kind of the first part of the wall. And then I want to add the same type of design into the wall right here. So we are going to go ahead and do that, and we're going to go ahead and do that. Now, we can also just go ahead and add the whole thing, like this. And you got to make sure that it is kind of... Uh, swinging a little bit, if that makes sense. So like, uh, it can't go in a natural, uh, unnatural straight line. It, that doesn't look good for a um, for a wall, uh, this type of wall at least, in my opinion. Uh, and then we can go ahead and just start to add a couple of things like this, uh, kind of making it a little bit random but also making sure that it's not too random. Uh, maybe we can even go like that. There. And maybe right there. And right here we're going to add one of these guys. We can go ahead and add something like so. Uh, just to kind of give it a little bit of depth. There we go. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Uh, where did... what was this again? I think that was a slab. And then we can go right there with that. And just adding a little bit of interest like this, I think, is working good. Now, another thing we can also do is, for example, right here... Uh, not there. Sorry. There. That's gonna work a bit better, I think. 
adding a little bit of uh, the cobble wall, cobblestone wall into the wall. <laughs> I think that works uh, very well. And then we're gonna go on all of these and just go a little bit crazy with these guys. We're gonna go right there. Maybe we can go right there, right there. I like going crazy with things. I, I enjoy that. Not right there, maybe, maybe... You know what? Right there. Yeah. I like that. Uh, there, there. 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 Just adding a little bit of interest into it, right? And then we're gonna go with a little bit of leaves going over like so. It, it needs to kind of come from somewhere, so I think we're gonna go like this. In the back here. Something like that. Uh, and it can even go up and over here. Uh, there we go. Just adding a little bit of rustic kind of feel to it, I think is... So sorry. I think it's good. Adding a little bit of interest like so. And then we're going to go with the same type of deal we did over here, where we kind of change out a little bit of textures around the wall. Uh, because I, I feel like that is quite important to this type of build. It, uh, it can't just be cobble all the way, or it's, it's going to be boring, it's going to be bland. It, it doesn't work well, in my opinion. So we can go ahead and add that one, that one, uh, that, and then we can go there, there, uh, there, uh, we can go there. Uh, did I not have any gravel? I did not. That's fine. There, 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 and... Yeah, it's starting to look a little bit interesting now, and uh, th this is this is getting along, uh, in my opinion. Uh, if we just go ahead and do that, I think. Yeah. Uh, and then I want to go into the wall again on this one. I forgot about right here. We're going to go there, we're going to go there, we're going to go... Um, yeah, we can go right here, we can go here. I, I want there to be wood in this building. Um, there we go, thank you. And maybe, uh, yeah, that's, that's a good beginning. But yeah, this is uh, how we're building it. Um, just going into the building itself and adding some... Uh, into the wall, I mean, and just adding a little bit of detail into it, a little bit of um, stairs, a little bit of slabs, a little bit of walls, and mixing it in with some textures, some uh, andesite, polished andesite, gravel, leaves, you know, in that order. <laughs> uh, just adding, adding a little bit of um, detail into the build itself, and that works very well. Now, another thing you can do is place a, place a little bit of slabs like so, and kind of um, giving it a little bit of height differences. I think that is a good thing. And adding a little bit of uh, a path uh, in it, kind of, uh, I think is uh, important as well. So just doing something like so. It doesn't need to be a big path, it just needs to kind of be there. And you can, you can make the path out of any type of block you want, it doesn't need to be the same type of material as the wall, but I think that using the same type of material will, will make it look a little bit more uh, trodden, kind of. And another thing 
uh, that I would like to do on Craft Theory, which I haven't done yet. L uh, I don't know why I've been playing with um, with the rain on. I really don't know. I'm so sorry about that. Uh, I, I didn't really register it. <laughs> um, but another thing that I would like to add on Craft Theory that I haven't done is adding a little bit of buttons from place to place. It's kind of a little bit of a... Um, uh just just a little bit of detail into it oh i can't add it there oh right there maybe on the grass as well um because uh the buttons can make some difference i just want to check how that could work like if we go in here and just add that Yeah, that could work. Uh, but yeah, that is basically how I built the wall. And this video is now one minute longer than I wanted it to be. So, with that, I think we're going to end the video. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, and if you want to see more types and type of videos like this, give me a request. And um, I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you did enjoy, don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And uh, I will catch you guys in the next video. Yeah. Okay. Bye-bye.